What is up, Smack Empire? Smack Empire here, and welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Poppy Playtime Chapter 2 video here on the channel. So, today, ladies and gentlemen, this is gonna be a small, quickie update video regarding Poppy Playtime. They have a new server, official Poppy Playtime server. I'll put a link into the description down below. They recently announced it on their Twitter. And if you join, we have some updates. It's basically like a recap to everything we know so far about Poppy Playtime Chapter 2 development wise. So, let's see what do we got here. It says here, quote, some info gathered from the developer related to chapter 2. Chapter 2 is pretty different and it will be improved in terms of visuals and gameplay. So it's gonna be interesting to see if they add some other gameplay mechanics other than just going around solving puzzles with, you know, two hands that we have. There are people going around saying there is a third hand. Even V made a video on the third hand possibility. You can check that video out. So we'll see. But I'm expecting a big jump in the visuals. I got a new graphics card. Hopefully that big boost in visuals. Like the game already looks phenomenal. Don't get me wrong. It is like in insanely good looking game but even if you get more visuals it's gonna be so freaking cool <laughs> excited for new locations and how they're gonna look out anyways Number two, the trailer for chapter two is in production and should be coming out soon. So let me give you a quick context behind this one. The last time when we got chapter two trailer, it was a long time ago, right? But then we learned about the partnership between Poppy Playtime and Dark Deception Monsters and Mortals. What surprised me is that before we didn't know who was going to be involved in Poppy Playtime DLC for Monsters and Mortals, right? However, what's fascinating is that it was revealed by Vincent Lemmings, not the creators of Poppy Playtime, but the developers of Monsters and Mortals and Dark Deception that Kissy Missy will be a playable character in Monsters and Mortals, a character being revealed by a separate developer and a character that is not even revealed for the official Poppy Playtime. So that was a big deal. There, I said, hey, we got the date for the DLC, which was quarter two of 2022. We learned that Poppy Playtime Chapter 2 is coming early 2022. And I said it here on the channel that in February, we're going to get Chapter 2 trailer alongside, hopefully, fingers crossed, release date for Chapter 2. We'll see. We'll see. But this confirms that a chapter 2 trailer is coming soon so this week next week it can happen at any second we don't know any second so stay tuned with this channel ladies and gentlemen reaction breakdown of the trailer theories gameplay all on this channel this is your go-to channel then number three lore will be expanding in chapter two it has to i mean it is chapter two the popularity of the game it is it just makes sense poppy needs to have a bigger role we need to understand what her intentions are if you want to keep it puzzly that's that actually works too you know whether she's on our side the good side she want to help us she want to help the monsters is she in the middle a gray area that that could work out but i'm excited for her role specifically and we can make other characters like Braun, Kissimissi, Huggy Wuggy, even more human because we know Huggy Wuggy is going soon in Poppy Playtime. Then Chapter 2 will bring bigger optimization. Please, yes, the game is nearly perfect but there are some issues in terms of optimization my new gpu even i was struggling a little bit in some areas for chapter one so hopefully more bigger optimization it's gonna help smooth the experience it says poppy playtime is aimed to premiere on as many platforms as possible so we're talking the f mobile ports we're talking the console ports every big game devs they say that they're trying to make sure it comes out on as many platforms as possible finals and freddy's that came out even vincent living said that they will get their game on consoles and phone but after chapter 5 as we know chapter 4 was out a few months ago and Vincent Living said okay we're gonna wait for chapter 5 when chapter 5 is out then as a whole they'll port it to the consoles so we'll see if mob games follow the same route of waiting for all chapters to be out first and then going for the consoles for it or maybe the chapter 2 will come out together as one for all the consoles for all the platforms the biggest player in the platforms for Poppy Playtime will be the Switch. Switch will play such an important role in the console sales. Game like this is begging to be ported on Switch. And if they can do that, if they can prioritize Switch and PC, trust me, their sales will rocket. Then it says chapter 2 will be much scarier, excited, hoping to get some more psychological horror element in the game. I'm talking more of a psychological horror, you know, letting your mind dictate what's scary for you. And then scaring the crap out of you. That is the scary part for me. So hopefully they dive deep into that aspect. Please, this is chapter 2. Please don't add fetch quests that take away the fun and heart of the game. Then it says more brain turning puzzles will appear in chapter 2. I expected that. See, I, ex I knew that. Alright, I expected that. I knew that the day will come. A day will come when this will happen. <laughs> So chapter two, it is more brain turning puzzles. And you know what? I wouldn't have it any other way. I wouldn't. I would want more brain turning puzzles. I want my brains to be working all the time. So you know what? I'll take it. And finally, chapter two is long. It has to. 
It, I mean, literally, it has to. I'm not even making this up because of the popularity, because it's following kind of sort of similar route for Bindi and Vik Machine. Chapter 1 was small, then Chapter 2 take it to the, took it to the next level. It still wasn't as big as Chapter 3, 4, or even 5, but to see how far they can stretch out Chapter 2, there has to be so much in Chapter 2 for fans to keep on eating until we get something to chapter 3 related. We don't even know how many chapters are going to be there. So hopefully the director Isaac makes his vision a little clearer that A, we have 5 chapters in planned or 4 chapters or how many chapters we got planned and we're going to try to t tell the story in this portion, in this whatever. So yeah, this is so far the current status, the current situation for Poppy Playtime Chapter 2. It's a lot of, basically it's a thing that we have already made videos on here on the channel. It's a thing we are already knew and these are just echoing the same thing, basically recapping where we are in terms of Poppy Playtime Chapter 2. But if you still want more, first of all, subscribe to this channel. And you can watch the whole playlist I made on this game. You can check that one out too. Ladies and gentlemen, I would leave you here. So if you're in the same boat as me, all you do is... And I'll see you in the next one.